Hello students, good morning. I hope you all are safe and healthy at your home. Welcome in lecture number 13, paper IC10, unit number 3. In previous lecture, we studied about drown draft gasifier, principal working mechanism and applications of drown draft gasifier. Now, in this lecture, we, we will study about problems associated with gasifier technology and second instrument for biomass that is biogas plant. So, first of all, we see problems associated with gasifier technology and then we will discuss about biogas plant. Problems associated with drown draft gasifier. Number one is fuel supply cost. These are the main important point. Fuel supply cost. The fuel requirement for gasifier vary from 1 to 1.3 kilogram per kilowatt depending on fuel properties such as calorific value, moisture content, ash content and conversion efficiency of the system. The Properties such as we list out here, that type of properties such as calorific value. It is very important property. Moisture content. If there is moisture content is high, then the cost of fuel supply is also high. So, moisture content, ash content. If this biomass material give more ash after the gasification process then fuel supply cost also increase and conversion efficiency it is all it is also very important conversion efficiency if biomass is not converted into producer gas then fuel supply cost is also increase. The feeding material of single type are not available round the year and hence need to be transport and store for continuous availability leading to inventory cost and transportation cost. Number two, capital cost and economic. In the economics, the capital charges for energy, operating cost, capacity utilization, etc. become important factors. This is also very important factor. Operating cost, capacity utilization, etc. Number three, point of view of safety. Producer gas is a low heating value of gas and is somewhat poisonous and explosive. Producer gas is low heating value and poisonous and explosive. So, point of view of safety, it is very dangerous. Hence, Proper co-metering arrangement as well as device must be provided in the system. The device which record the producer gas. So, it is must require co-metering arrangement for producer gas in gasifier. Number 4. Technology development. The following under areas which needs further technical development. Number one, 
जामिंग एसोसिएटेड विथ हैंडलिंग ऑफ फीड मटीरियल और एश इनसाइड एंड आउटसाइड द गैसिफायर दिस इज वेरी इम्पोर्टंट पॉइंट जामिंग एसोसिएटेड विथ द हैंडलिंग ऑफ फीड मटीरियल एंड प्रोड्यूस एश इन गैसिफायर सो दिस इज वेरी इम्पोर्टंट जामिंग प्रॉब्लम एंड नंबर टू lack of oven gas i repeat lack of oven gas clean up system which results in formulation of tar tar is also obtained in gasification of biomass so the tar resulting in wearing of engine cylinder piston etc so this is very also important problems these four are the main problems associated with gasifier here we complete detail account of drown duct gasifier now next point is biogas plant first of all we see classification of biogas plant and then we discuss it biogas plants can be classified under three types these are the main three types continuous or batch type biogas plant number 2 dome and drum type biogas plant and variation in domes let us we discuss this one by one first of all we see continuous type biogas plant continuous type biogas plant is divided into two types or continuous type biogas plant is classified into two types number 1 single digester and number 2 double digester we will see in this lecture both continuous type biogas plant first of all we see single digester continuous type biogas plant here described figure is single stage digester continuous type biogas plant see the different types of arrangement in biogas plant this type of plant contains only single digester and their compartment is gas storage and gas domes scum layer supernatant layer active digestion part and digested sludge storage and then outlet so this type of equipment is single digester continuous type biogas plant there is a series or single digester and once raw material is charged regularly and processes goes on continuously the entire process may be complete in single stage or in two stage in this described equipment is only single stage is only single stage single stage continuous type biogas plant serious problems are encountered with agricultural residue when the formed in single stage continuous process we show here some different types of equipment also i derive second equipment also in this space this is the main problem 
एग्रीकल्चरल रेसिड्यू व्हेन फर्मेंटेड इन सिंगल स्टेज कंटिन्यूस प्रोसेस नाउ वी डिस्कस डबल स्टेज कंटिन्यूस टाइप बायोगैस प्लांट एंड देयर मैकेनिज्म द गैस जनरेशन प्रोसेस टेक्स प्लेस स्लोली एंड इन टू टू स्टेज एज शोन इन दिस फिगर हियर वी शो द फिगर डबल स्टेज कंटिन्यूस टाइप बायोगैस प्लांट इन द फर्स्ट स्टेज एज शोन इन फिगर इन द फर्स्ट स्टेज द कॉम्प्लेक्स ऑर्गेनिक सब्सटेंसिस is contained in the waste are acted by a certain kind of bacteria called acid formers and are broken up into small chain simple acids the biomass contains heavy molecules of organic compound so in first stage the organic substance is converted into small simple acids and this type of bacteria is called acidophormers acid former bacteria in the second stage this acid are acted upon by another kind of bacteria which produce methane and carbon dioxide this type of bacteria in second stage in first stage the organic substances are converted into small chain acids therefore the bacteria present in first stage is known as acid former bacteria and in second stage the acids are converted into methane and carbon dioxide so this type of bacteria are known as methanogenic bacteria so in first stage acidogenic and in second stage methanogenic thus acidogenic and methanogenic stages are separated in two chambers while in single stage both the bacteria are present in only single digester system so first of all bacteria reacted acid and then it converted into methane and carbon dioxide now futures of continuous plant both type of single digester continuous type or double digester continuous type plant some point of futures number 1 it will produce gas continuously here continuously input and output process is continue so we get gas continuously number 2 it will require small digester or chamber in above these type of figures in all figures the digester or digesting chamber is small so it is not require high area number 3 it will require lesser period of digestion it requires less time so digestion process is not lengthy number 4 it has less problems compared to batch type in next lecture we will studying about batch type biogas plant so with compared to batch type biogas plant it has less problems and number 
it is easier in operation handling and input and output of material it is very easy process so it is easier in operation so these are the features of continuous biogas plant from the classification of biogas plant here we complete first type continuous type biogas plant and in this lecture we discuss about single stage biogas plant and double stage continuous type biogas plant i have some videos for this type of biogas plant it is attached here please enjoy the videos formation of biomass animal manure or cow dung and green trees are the main raw material or component of biogas plant these compounds are in biogas plant use this is simple biogas plant we see the mechanism input material is charge and in single stage or in double stage there is two type of process takes place one is formation of acids and second is formation of methane and carbon dioxide this type of gas is utilized in our different types of uses this is second emination video for our household purposing and industry biomass produce biogas mechanism and construction of biogas plant biomass is input or the formation of biogas is then transfer to our household purpose production of electricity and waste material is best fertilizer for our farming process thank you